ladies eh venye wana dispose hizo manini zao sanitary towels ni unaona mfano mtu akisha kunywa yogurt kaa hii anaichukua anaiweka ndani kama hizi hapa hivi unachukua sanitary towel naweka kuna medicinal waste kama hizi sasa unaona ngine unapata ziko na dawa ndani especially hizi za HIV ndio tunapata pia mingi sana kwa huku kwa takataka cause unapata mtu aliacha kumeza maybe pengine ako disease alikufa sada dawa zote zinachukuliwa zina zinatupwa tu kwa kwa bill wanaangalia tu profit products zao lakini waangalizo at the end of the day the waste zinapatikana hizi ndio waste zinazipata kwa mto zinajipata kwa illegal dumping sites zinakasama naona so sasa sisi tunaenda tunazi tunazi buy tunazi recycle Chola Maxwell Otieno, uh, a resident of Lakisama, founder of Better Living Empowerment Program. Uh, it's a community-based organization here in Lakisama. It was formed back in 2013 as a community-based organization that brings together children, youth, and women in order to participate in sports and work education program. In a larger extent, we also do uh, uh, waste management from the household level uh, up to uh, recycling processes whereby we view uh, recycling as a source of livelihood and uh, waste management too as another catapulting source of livelihood so unaona hizi zinaitwa ngadamba la makirinda damba la makirinda but lakini bado tunafanywa sorting bado tujafanya sorting ziko tu zote hivyo nini so tunaandikishaga kuna madem wanakami kufanya job hapa mama mama wanakuja wanafanya sorting tunawalipa pengine shilingi moja kwa kilo ama 100 shilingi moja na sumni kwa kilo depending na nature ya plastics tumepata kama ni hizi wa sheke sheke sana hizi ndogo ndogo tunaweza kufanyisha na 150 kama ni hizi kubwa kubwa nini ni bop kwa sababu si ni kitu tu unaona tu una, unaweka into colors na quality One thing that motivated me to to start uh, this CBO is that uh, one we had challenges within the community as uh, you can see youths uh, had challenges in, uh, in 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 having jobs and also the community was not organized since uh, even here in our community we don't have a, a single amenity social amenity it is only that uh, today we are having uh, a uh, public hospital which is coming up that it is not yet over it has taken more than 5 years to be constructed that's the only public amenity that we have in within the community and we saw that we should not be part of uh, uh, a society that only go to seek for jobs we can also create jobs how we can come up with these simple available resources in order for us to come up with how we can uh, uh, raise uh, revenues and also how we can participate in financial inclusion in our own minimal ways through a process ya kufanya sorting kuna mado advantages tunapata dua jinsi moja kama hiyo ni kuna zenye zinaitwa ngorodha orodha ni things like vitu zimetumika lakini mwenye alio na minunu wengine wacha weke hii wacha weke hii kando kuna vitu kama chaja chaja unaweza pata kichwa kicho uko nao peke yake tena uendele kufanya sorting upate kumangukia cable ukiunganisha uende weki kwa steam uko na full charge na hizi pia orodha vile zinaitwa orodha kuna vile pia ziko na market tukiziweka kugunia by the time zifike gunia moja hiyo ni profit pande yetu yenye tukipeleka kwa market ya orodha tu peke yake ni 1000 each per gunia kila gunia moja ni 1000 hapo hivyo utapata imarishi ya watu wengine kazi wa mama vibanda wa kuza machipo utapata kuna vitu zao hapo utapata kuna mavijiko zimekurishia kazi kama mafuta mafuta pate ah kuna mwenye alitumia lakini akonaenda kuisha kidogo 
wacha si malizia iwacha so na ukikama pa koroda ingine hata utapata tu hata wezi kuzia juu ni mafuta ni kitu shatu mikanus wezi kuzia na runua wenda runua chaja hata kuongezea discount ya mafuta the recycling project by the first of all we were not into recycling project and we were not even doing garbage collection previously we came into garbage collection uh, by hand in hand hand in hand is the one that introduced us and they were ready to come and train us they trained us that there is also some value out of those waste whereby there are some plastic nylons there is a uh, glass glasses there are uh, cotton boxes uh, several things that one can see as trash uh, even food that has remained that are thrown in the in the trash is also useful to someone else so the moment when they trained us uh, we saw that there is that great need and there was a consortium of a lot of groups that was brought in together and we continued with the training and uh, the moment when we were supposed to set up a, a, a recycling center they saw that we are so enthusiastic and uh, they decided to facilitate us with uh, this uh, container uh, 20 feet container uh, they also facilitated us with uh, a shredding machine and also uh, a baler, a, a baling machine. This shredding machine we shred uh, plastics that uh, from uh, P from PVC plastic to HD plastics, uh, mainly blow and injection. Sasa kuna time kuna mama dawa kusort wa kikam tuna tafuti ya maneti kuna maneti hizi za umbu hizi tu zinatumia kwa nyumba hizi tunatandika chini tukishatandika chini tunamwaga hizi ma plastic yake alafu tunaanza kusort hizi za black zina kwa kando ningana tuna makala sisi hizi pia kando yellow pia kando hizi ma za yogurt hizi ma injection za white ni kando kishato ka hiyo process za kusortiwa out na kuja tunazimwaga hii area kishazi mwaga hii area sao moparita kuna oroparita wawili wanaka hapa kwa mashini alafu mmoja atakuwa na zi receive hapa kishasi kwa hapa kisi yako ikija hapa ana receive akizieka kwa magunia zinu venye tumeweka hizi tushasiaga kwa gunia hapa tunafunga tunapima tunaweka aside inakuja inaandikishwa kani injection blue ama blue black inaandikishwa kwa hiyo gunia ambapo tukienda kwa soko wakishao na tu label ni hiyo wanajua venye wanapanga kwa store yao so, kitu kingine pia tunaweza fanya na hii shughuli ni eh, ku audit takataka na venye takataka pia inatresiwa na makampuni gani zenye zina produce a lot of uh, west kwa 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 society ama kwa community kama hii kamp hii rina ni akapa oil refineries limited no no so hao ndio wame produce hii hii ni a pwani oil eh hii ni gendoguri process unpacked by gendoguri dairy farmers cooperative society no no hii ni all the way from gendoguri imenini hapa hivi alafu unapata huyu ni Delis yogurt sasa unakamu na light hizo makampuni alafu unaanza kuandika oh hii ni ya kampuni gani na ika tumepata one tumepata two hivyo 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 so unakamu unapata audit yake so hiyo audit inaweza saidia pia serikali ikienda ku trace hao wasi wana wana produce waste mingi kwa kwa kwa, kwa society na wezi zi trace back na pia afanyi chochote ku support mambo ya waste management so in the future we are planning that uh, besides ku, kuzisiaga kuzipeleka kwa market tunataka pia tuanze ku mold tunacheki kama sasa hivi kwa kuna housing project inaendelea na ni kitu inaenda ku run for a long period of time so tunataka at least in the future to to participate kwa hizo ma projects tunataka tutengeneze plastic bricks brick kama hizi lakini za plastic eh zenye yeah. zinterlock Better living empowerment program has been a paradigm shift within the community because the moment when we 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 started this organization the community used to have a lot of problems in terms of uh, of, of criminal activities at least it has reduced uh, similarly young people always shun themselves from participating in such organizations 
For example, issues to do with waste management, they saw it as it is only meant for people who have not gone to school. So they saw that great need of maybe engaging into criminal activities for young boys and also young girls who saw that they can't do such, they ended up engaging into issues to do with prostitution and something. So we are looking forward to have a network or something that at least we can pull them together in order for them to bring cohesion.